History of Soy Milk Soy milk, a dairy-free alternative to cow's milk, has been around for centuries. Its roots can be traced back to ancient China, where it was developed around the 2nd century BCE. The Chinese used soybeans to make a variety of foods, including tofu, soy sauce, and soy milk. Soy milk became a popular beverage in China during the Tang Dynasty and was often consumed as a replacement for cow's milk, which was not widely available. From China, soy milk spread to other parts of Asia, including Japan and Korea, where it also became a popular drink. In the early 20th century, soy milk started to gain popularity in the Western world as a dairy-free alternative to cow's milk. In the United States, soy milk was first sold commercially in the 1920s by a company called Vitasoy. However, it was not until the 1970s and 1980s that soy milk began to gain widespread popularity as a health food. It was marketed as a low-fat, cholesterol-free alternative to cow's milk and was particularly popular among people with lactose intolerance or who followed a vegan or vegetarian diet. The process for making soy milk in ancient China involved soaking the soybeans, grinding them into a paste, and then boiling the mixture with water. The resulting liquid was then strained, and the remaining solids were used to make tofu. This process resulted in a creamy and slightly sweet drink that was enjoyed by many. Soy milk was often consumed hot, and it was sometimes flavored with ginger, honey, or other spices. Soy milk is a nutritious and healthy beverage that offers a range of benefits. Soy milk is an excellent source of protein, providing around 7 to 8 grams per cup. This makes it a great choice for vegetarians and vegans who may struggle to get enough protein in their diets. Soy milk is naturally low in saturated fat, which is linked to an increased risk of heart disease. Choosing soy milk over cow's milk can be a good way to reduce your saturated fat intake. Soy milk is lactose-free, making it a good choice for people who are lactose intolerant. Rich in vitamins and minerals, soy milk is fortified with vitamins and minerals, including calcium, vitamin D, and vitamin B12. This makes it a good choice for people who may not get enough of these nutrients from other sources. Some studies have found that consuming soy protein can lower LDL, bad, cholesterol levels in the blood, which is a risk factor for heart disease. Some studies have suggested that consuming soy products, including soy milk, may help reduce the risk of breast and prostate cancer. Soy milk is a good source of calcium, which is important for maintaining healthy bones. Regular consumption of soy milk may help improve bone density and reduce the risk of osteoporosis. Overall, soy milk is a nutritious and healthy alternative to cow's milk, and it can offer a range of health benefits. It's important to choose unsweetened varieties of soy milk, as some flavored varieties can be high in added sugars. Is it okay to drink soy milk every day? Yes, it is generally safe to drink soy milk every day as part of a balanced and varied diet. Soy milk is a good source of protein, vitamins, and minerals, and can be a healthy alternative to cow's milk for people who are lactose intolerant or who follow a vegan or vegetarian diet. 1 to 2 8-ounce servings of soy milk per day is considered safe. However, it's important to choose unsweetened varieties of soy milk, as some flavored varieties can be high in added sugars. It's also important to consume soy products in moderation, as excessive intake may have negative health effects. For example, consuming very high amounts of soy products may affect thyroid function in some people. As with any food, it's important to consider your individual dietary needs and speak with a healthcare provider or registered dietitian if you have any concerns about consuming soy milk or other soy products. Who should not drink soy milk? While soy milk can be a healthy and nutritious beverage for many people, there are some groups of people who may want to avoid or limit their intake of soy milk. Infants should not be given soy milk as a replacement for breast milk or infant formula, as it does not provide the necessary nutrients for their growth and development. Some people may be allergic to soy and should avoid consuming soy milk or other soy products. Soy contains compounds called goitrogens, which can interfere with thyroid function in some people. While this is generally not a concern for most people, those with thyroid issues may want to limit their intake of soy milk.
Some medications, such as certain types of hormone replacement therapy, may interact with soy and should be avoided or limited when consuming soy products. Soy milk can be difficult to digest for some people, particularly those with digestive issues such as irritable bowel syndrome, IBS. As with any dietary change, it's important to speak with a healthcare provider or registered dietitian if you have any concerns about consuming soy milk or other soy products. Does soy milk affect hormones? Some people are concerned that consuming soy products, including soy milk, may disrupt hormones and have negative health effects. However, the evidence on the effects of soy on hormones is mixed. While some studies have suggested that consuming high amounts of soy products may have a slight estrogenic effect in the body, other studies have found no significant effects. Most research suggests that moderate consumption of soy products is safe and does not have significant effects on hormone levels or fertility. However, people with a history of hormone-sensitive cancers or who are undergoing treatment for these cancers may want to avoid or limit their intake of soy products, as the estrogen-like effects of soy may interfere with treatment. As with any dietary change, it's important to speak with a healthcare provider or registered dietitian if you have concerns about the effects of soy milk or other soy products on your hormones or overall health. Can we cook soy milk? Yes, you can cook with soy milk just like you would with regular dairy milk. Soy milk can be used in a variety of recipes including soups, sauces, desserts, and baked goods. However, it's important to keep in mind that soy milk has a slightly different taste and texture compared to dairy milk, so you may need to adjust the recipe accordingly. When cooking with soy milk, it's also important to avoid overheating it, as this can cause the soy proteins to coagulate and form lumps. To prevent this, it's best to heat soy milk slowly and stir it constantly. Additionally, if you're using soy milk as a substitute for cream in a recipe, you may need to add a bit of cornstarch or another thickening agent to achieve a similar consistency. Overall, soy milk can be a versatile and delicious alternative to dairy milk in cooking and baking. Here are some recipe ideas that use soy milk. Creamy Vegan Tomato Soup In a large pot, saute chopped onions and garlic until translucent. Add canned tomatoes, vegetable broth, and soy milk, and bring to a simmer. Puree the mixture until smooth and season with salt and pepper. Vegan Mac and Cheese Cook elbow macaroni according to package instructions. In a separate saucepan, whisk together soy milk, nutritional yeast, Dijon mustard, garlic powder, and salt. Heat the mixture over medium heat until it thickens, then stir in the cooked pasta. Chocolate Pudding Whisk together soy milk, cornstarch, sugar, cocoa powder, and salt in a saucepan over medium heat. Stir constantly until the mixture thickens, then remove from heat and stir in vanilla extract. Pour into serving dishes and chill until set. Vegan Pancakes Whisk together flour, baking powder, sugar, and salt in a bowl. In a separate bowl, whisk together soy milk, vegetable oil, and vanilla extract. Add the wet ingredients to the dry ingredients and stir until just combined. Cook the pancakes on a greased griddle or frying pan. Vegan Mushroom Stroganoff Sauté sliced mushrooms and chopped onions in a pan until the mushrooms release their moisture. Add soy milk, vegetable broth, Dijon mustard, and Worcestershire sauce, and bring to a simmer. Add cooked egg noodles and serve topped with chopped parsley. These are just a few examples of the many delicious recipes that can be made with soy milk. Feel free to experiment and substitute soy milk in your favorite recipes. Today, soy milk is consumed around the world and is available in a variety of flavors, including vanilla, chocolate, and strawberry. It is often used as a milk substitute in cooking and baking and is a popular choice for people with lactose intolerance or who follow a vegan or vegetarian diet. Thank you for watching this video on the history of soy milk. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more content like this. Have a great day!